uh, our profile tells a lot about us. And here we uh, comes to another question. What are the major things to create an identity in a way that attract more clients? There's two ways that I describe LinkedIn. Uh, number one to me, LinkedIn is the world's largest database of businesses, their owners and their employees. And when you think about that, I'm sure you'll agree that's exactly what it is. Yeah. It's also a tool that you use to get a conversation started. And your profile pays, plays an important part in that. Okay. So what should your profile include? When somebody opens up your profile, the first three things that they initially notice are your banner image, yeah. your face pic, and your headline. Okay. Um, now your banner image, I describe it's being a little bit like the cover of a book. If you can imagine you walk into a bookstore, it's, it's the cover of that book. It's the title of that book that grabs your attention and you'll take that book off the shelf and you'll flick through it and decide if you're going to take the next step and purchase that book. Well, your banner image is what entices the viewer or reader of your profile to want to read further. It's one of the first things that really stands out that they see. Uh, your face pic always try to have a nice uh, uh, attractive face pic and there's a platform that you can use to actually test your face pics uh, oh, wow. it's called photofeeler.com uh, one tip with regards to um, face pics it's always a good idea to try and have a face pic with a clear non-distracting background a, a preferably a white background the, the next thing that i would also recommend is to have a headline that also talks to your audience and there's a very simple, very straightforward uh, headline strategy, which is I help X and X is your target audience. So I help your target audience achieve Y and Y is their most desired result with my Z, which can be your products, your services, your process, etc. OK, 